Good, wouldn't it? It'd be great mm, for us too. It would, yeah. Now take a look at this. Isn't that fantastic? It is a prosthetic hand. You can see its fingers moving there, but it's been made in a very different way. This has been made by teenagers in Leeds using 3D printer. I can't imagine this at all. Now, students at the newly opened University Technical College are planning to help children, not only here in Yorkshire, but also those who have lost limbs in landmine explosions in Africa. Emma Glasby can explain this. Yeah. Take a group of teenagers from Leeds, a few 3D printers. The remarkable result is a prosthetic hand. At Leeds' newest school, the University Technical College, students are using the very latest technology to transform the lives of children around the world. The whole point is to help them have a closer to normal life, like the same as us, so they can run around, push toys, trolleys, drink um, by holding cups without um, any outside help. It feels good to actually <laughs> help other people, right? You know you're helping other people, changing their lives. We're going to be probably working with more UK-based children. So children in Yorkshire, children in North Yorkshire, Leeds, maybe children in Third World, anywhere that needs it, really. They're working with a global charity to help not only children born without limbs, but also those who've suffered devastating injuries in landmine explosions. The students tell the printers what to do, and the printers get to work. So what's happening on these printers? Right, so on this printer right here, we have the palm part of the hand. Uh, this part will have the strings running through it onto the wrist. Right here we have the fingers, and right here we have the main wrist unit that we print flat and then it gets moulded uh, into the shape of your wrist. And how long do these printers take to make these? Well this one right here is going to take 11 hours. They do take quite a while. In a couple of years time this will be done in 11 minutes. So could the NHS reap the benefits of these printers? The NHS pays thousands of pounds for prosthetic hands. Using these 3D printers this costs around £35. From a school in Leeds to children thousands of miles away, with the help of some very clever printers. Emma Glasby, BBC Look North, Leeds. Very clever indeed. Just £45 pounds to make, amazing. Fantastic.